Okay, I've been asked to tell you a little bit more about um, my diagnosis of, uh, of tongue cancer and, um, and tell you a little bit more about the story and what it kind of looks like as well because um, <laughs> you won't believe this but, uh, but actually three dentists um, diagnosed my situation as being a problem with a wisdom tooth. Yep, they said that um, I had a wisdom tooth that was growing through, and I am 47, <laughs> and it was actually causing me to have an inflammation in my gum and an inflammation on my tongue. Well, I know that when I looked at it, it, it didn't look really quite right. It, it looked like an ulcer. It was, it was really kind of um, uh, knocking against my teeth as well. So my teeth were sort of chopping into it a little bit. It was so painful. But every time I went to the dentist, they said, no, 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 it's absolutely fine. It is this wisdom tooth problem. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna get you referred to the hospital to get the wisdom tooth out. Well, four months later and three rounds, well, I know, not three, four rounds of antibiotics and being continuously told to salt gargle and take ibuprofen and be rather patted on the head saying, no, 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 it's not cancer or anything like that, girl, you know, you know, this isn't what it is. Um, and, you know, I had all of that. And so I had this kind of feeling that everything was going to be all right and I was just going to have this wisdom tooth operation. Well, anyway, when I finally did eventually end up at the Royal Barks Hospital and sitting in the orthodontist chair, well, he then just suddenly said to me, well, it doesn't really look like a wisdom tooth. In fact, it, what is that on your tongue? How long has it been there? And I said, well, it's been there for about four months. And uh, he then really panicked and he said, look, we need to do a biopsy. And then the rest is history because obviously they found cancer. Now, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to show you what it looks like. I hope you can see it. So um, I'm going to move my phone up towards me and see if you can see this. There it is, the little bugger. So um, that's kind of what it looks like. But you know what? It didn't really look like that uh, four months ago. It was a lot smaller. Um, and it didn't look so lumpy as well. So what I am trying to tell you is, uh, you know, if you have an ulcer in your mouth and it's been there for longer than three weeks, um, because let's uh, understand all this, I mean, your mouth is one of the quickest places to heal in your body. So if you have a problem like that, you really, really must get it seen to as quickly as possible. You know, no running away. Uh, I know we all don't like going to dentists and things like that, but we do need to have those things seen to. Anyway, so that's the story. Um, and I'll be back soon to fill you in on more of my journey. Bye.